All right, so today is the day that I uh, test fired Piet. The charges range. Well, the charge, the highest charge I have is about four grains more than the lowest charge. Lowest charge is a standard that you're supposed to be using according to the manuals that I found. And uh, so yeah, you'll see two shots with this thing just uh, leaned up against a tree because uh, yeah, I don't want to risk my first shots with uh, my new my new practice round by shoulder firing it. I really didn't want to risk uh, getting hurt if the tube didn't hold up, but it held up or it held up great and uh, yeah, you're gonna see some nice uh, launches with it. First shoulder firing with a helmet and goggles on. All right, test firing trying to hit something over there that probably won't hit. That was fun. All right, so as you saw, they seem to launch great. The lowest one actually recocks it properly, so I don't have to worry about going any higher with it. I chose the right kind of powder to replace the originals. And uh, yeah, I guess I'm gonna make a few more rounds for it, or cartridges for launching, and uh, let other people try it. Seeing as uh, it is a fun thing to shoot, it kicks like a mule, but it's not really that bad, because it's a soft, uh, Impulse, I guess you'd call it. Sorry about the wind. I can't really choose my days. It is a beautiful day out here. It's hovering around zero Celsius, 32 degrees. But there is a wind. Anyways, hope you enjoyed that. And uh, I'm going to have to go check my Piat here and see if it actually uh, survived it properly without any damage. If it starts damaging, I'm not going to fire it anymore. But if I seem to see it... Uh, doing well I have no reason not to fire it some more so it is a fun thing to use nice piece of history to try out not many people get to use them anymore anyways thanks for watching if you enjoy these kind of things always uh, click the subscribe button once in a while I'll make the videos and they usually have to do with topics like this so have a good one